All right, guys, so we're about to go catch some bait fish right now, Wesson. Is that yes, what we're sir. doing? We're going to see if we get some greenbacks, maybe some thread fins, something like cool. that. Cool. So we're actually at this RV resort over here at St. Pete. It's a beautiful area. You know, we're out here on the water. And wait till you see how beautiful this place is. A-dub in the back. A-dub in the back. We're just living life, guys, enjoying it to the fullest. What, what day are we on? Away? Four or five? What's up? This is day five. Day five. I think we got five days, six days. Five six days, days. Five days after this, Four. until Friday morning we leave. But we're gonna be traveling all around. It's gonna be a good time. Guys, Come look check at out this place. water. That's right Salty Austin. What's going on? What up, boys? My name is Weston. You guys probably know me though. <laughs> you get him? You got him? <laughs> Throw in there, Weston. This is a good oh. one. Whoa. Oh my God, he's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. All right, just grab it. All right, I got no, it. No, you're gonna freaking do something stupid. Just grab it. Stop. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they're right there. You can see them shining, can't you? Yeah, I, I see can just it. see a little bit of like glimmering under there. All right, watch out, guys. Move in your shadow. That was terrible. Oh yeah, we got some. Did we? Oh yeah. Got yeah, a yeah there's some in there for sure. Oh yeah. You want to put them in this bucket? Yeah. So we're catching some live bait right now. But I have a good That's time. Actually... So we're out here. You know, we got Weston. He has a seven foot cast net, trying to catch some bait. What are those called, Weston? These are maharas. Mahara. It's a little one inch bait fish, two inch bait fish. Yeah, this is not what we're looking for though. We're looking for greenbacks. How big are greenbacks? Well, they can be that size, but they can also be bigger. Keep you posted. Super windy today. Yeah, it really right. is. It's going to be a blast. Really We're actually to supposed to go on a saltwater trip with my boy Wes. And, and yeah, sadly, unfortunately, we got blown out. It's like yeah. four to six foot offshore. Yeah. We're out here at the RV resort, staying positive, man, having a good time. Hopefully, we're going to get on them today. I'm trying to get you guys some saltwater stuff because this is so new to me. That's money. Get her done. Hey, that a boy. He's got like 20. This is my man Salty right here. Why do they call you Salty if I may ask? Uh, Just kind of stuck or something? Always, always in the salt water. <laughs> I might not take a shower every couple days. <laughs> From working to fishing. So we're at Bay Pines Bait and Tackle. We're actually about to go in here right now and get some shrimp, doing something different. Super excited about it. Got my boy Weston back there, got Hunter, got Christian. What's up, what's uh, up? Man, it's just a blessing to be out here doing this. We're gonna go inside, get some bait, vlog a little bit. It's gonna be fun, man, let's get it. Probably. Live shrimp? Yeah. We got some other baits too, and then we can throw our fish as well. But what is this, Wes? What's this? Those are some more, uh, no, there's some pinfish there. And then we got grunts over here. Pinfish? And then grunt? Yeah. Oh, those are cool, man. Those, those are one of my favorite snook baits, but that's more of like, you only really throw bigger baits in like, kind of like the, the, uh, the summertime. Yeah. You know, I mean, you can catch them like that, but maybe more of like a nighttime thing. <laughs> I got my boys down from Georgia. They ain't never caught a snook before, so we're gonna try some snook. What's up, man? How you doing? No. Oh, yeah. Nice to meet you. Definitely. Good dog. I miss my dog, man. Dog <laughs> passed away two years ago. Hey, man. man. Heartbreaking. And that didn't what kind of was he? What's up? What kind of was he? They were, I had one beagle boxer, um, awesome really? dog, dude. awesome dog, his name was Max, then we had another dog named Tootsie, um, she was a schnauzer, I had a dog named Tootsie, she looked like a big Tootsie roll, the really? sweetest dog, dude, <laughs> like she just had such of a personality, and that's like weird to right. see a dog, but like, no, that, that's just true. look at her, she's wagging her tail, like she's <laughs> the happiest, man, she passed away a year ago, Dang, like, like from this month, so, man. missing your dog, this is Max and Tootsie, that's my granddad. Yeah, I mean, I was it's the man that got me into fishing. I wouldn't be doing this too. So just talked to Weston. Um, we're actually going to be going to a spillway, which is dope, man. Like, I've always wanted to fish some spillways. I fish one or two every once in a while, but uh, that's like the YouTube thing right now is the spillways. So we're going to go out there, have a good time, fish with that live shrimp, 
this is something new to me. I mean, if you guys want to see some more content like this, hit the like button. I want to know. Leave your feedback down below. Um, it's going to be a blast though, but I'm just blessed to be out here today in Florida. I want to be in this position if it wasn't for you guys, and I mean that. Man, it's just a powerful day. I'm feeling it, man. Everybody around me is just laughing yeah, at me. I'm, I'm just I'm feeling it, bro. Energetic. I very, happy. very energetic right now. I just right want to make people happy, and I'm just like, dude, I don't know what it is, but I like woke up today. Dude, I was so exhausted. Like, six hours of sleep in four days. I just like got four hours of sleep last night. I feel like a new human. Popped the five hour energy, dude. I'm just rocking, dude. We're gonna kill it, man. Making people's day. You know, one thing, just, I, I wanna put this out to the world too. Like, for 2021, try doing at least one good thing a day. Whether it's like holding the door open to somebody or asking them how their day's been. You know, meeting new people. Go do that, man. Put good, goodness into the world. Positive vibes. Positive, positive vibes. vibes. 2020, like, Bro, so many, so much negativity. We're knocking that out, yeah. bro. We're knocking that out. We're keeping it real this year. This is the takeover, man. This is fun stuff. Chilling with the boys. This is a blessing, man. This is a blessing. Weston, what's up, man? It feels good just to like come out here. It's like refreshing, bro. Just oh, to goodness. like, you know, come out and see you again. It's been like four years, dude. Yeah, man. I know. It's been way too long. I gotta wait on KTV Mobile. What do you think we should name the RV, bro? Ooh. Drop your comments <laughs> down below. What do you, what do you think? Oh my goodness. How about the Bass Bus? Bass Bus? Not bad. Dude, I kind of like Hi that. Hype Bus? Hype Bus? Dude, what? Hype Bus? Not bad. the top of the Bass Bus. <laughs> Dude, that's pretty Yo, sweet. Yo, that's kind of awesome. Bus? With the wrap, should we get Bass Bus on there? I think Bass Bus. On the front? Like awesome. the Bass, bass Bus? bus? That's, the that's, bus that might be a thing. Right on the front? That might be yeah. the thing. That might be the might move. Be the move. But you guys drop your comments down below, man. I'd, I'd love to... Man, another thing, you know what's gonna be cool? Mm. We're just speaking everything out, yeah, bro. Yeah, honestly. Behind, like, we're just raw here. Um, I wanna leave a spot on the RV, so if we meet, like, supporters, they can sign so, it, That would be awesome. That would be really it. cool. That's like, if I meet you man. guys in person, Do? We're, we're gonna have some big meetups, man. Big things coming. Um, get you guys to sign it, that would be dope. But drop some comments down below. We're gonna head to the, ran or the spillway. Yeah, we're gonna hit the spillway. And maybe a couple other spots, depending on. Well, we just got to see how it goes. You know, it's fishing for a reason. So, well, today we got a uh, a wind that's coming at a a weird direction for where we're we're at. There's a lot of fishing this way, but we got to fish this way if we want to get away from the wind. So we got a couple spots up our sleeve as to where we can go. Um, hopefully, we can find some calm water, places that we can get some nice long cast at. Hopefully, some fish will be holding there this time of year. The water temp's like in the mid 60s, so it's a little cooler than it usually is, especially for here in Florida. So these fish, especially like the snook and redfish and uh, trout, like the, our inshore species, they tend to uh, get off main water and kind of go in the cuts and the creeks, back in the uh, like the backwater of the bay. So we're gonna try that, those areas right on uh, some like oyster beds and hopefully there'll be some fish there. We got some uh, nice hand-picked shrimp. I'm gonna free line a couple of those, maybe try uh, some artificials as well, like some paddle tails, maybe some live targets or something. Um, I'm really hoping we get on some fish. I'm gonna go scout them out and Try to bend some rods. This is a size 2 aught gamakatsu circle hook. It's so, got the octopus eye as well. So you just reel like. right into them, no hook set. Yeah. So what I like to do is you're gonna, if it's a snook, you're gonna feel a, you're gonna feel a thump in the rod. Yeah. And then your rod will kind of bend up. Yeah. And when that bends up, all I want you to do is get those initial five or six cranks, and then I mean, if it's a decent size snook, it's probably gonna make a, like a little run. Yeah. And then if he's running, let him run. I like my drag fairly loose. Especially since we're fishing like lighter tackle, lighter rods. Sure. I don't like to horse them in. Yeah. Um, so yeah, just uh, circle hooks. Don't set up the hook because you will yank it out of its mouth. I mean, no. you can get a hook set with a circle hook, but most time you, you want to reel just, it in. You just want to crank. And we're yeah, free line. Really wanna, no, we're free no weight. No weight. No weight. Cool. Um, any scissors? We also got shrimp, minnows, or shiners, whatever you're gonna call them. Yeah, we got some mahara. This spot right here, you got bass on the left and you got snook on the right. Fresh water and salt water. It's pretty awesome. Oh, dude, we, we haven't had a lot of rain, so the, the spillway is not really spilling out too much. They're busting. They're busting. I want you guys to grab yourself a shrimp if you can find one, like a nice hefty one like this. And so you're going to take your hook, all right? And here's how you're going to hook them right here through this back part. Hook exposed like that. Then give it a nice cast out there. And you're just going to free line it, kind of keep your bail open. And when you feel a thump, close your bail. How do we land this fish, bro? We'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> like that's a big fish. Cause I gotta take a picture if I catch one, bro. Yeah, we'll get it. I'll, I'll make sure I get it. On shrimp, you can catch a lot of different fish here. They're they're busting right on top Did there. You catch snook. Yep, snook. Yo, 
You can catch snook, you can catch redfish, you can catch tarpon, you can catch cobia on shred. Is there tarpon in here? Uh, there's little juvenile tarpon in here. See, yep. where are you at? I'm over here. Hey, they're, bu they're busting that's that out in the left. Battle. Yeah, they're busting right there, I see them. All right, so we're gonna go over here by the other boys. Man, I just really wanna hook a big snook. That would be insane. You got bit? Hunter watched it. Dude, it was literally like. Where at? What'd you do? I just, it was like 30 foot right out here. Didn't even throw it very far. To just throw it? Yeah, I just tossed it out there. Like that? Like, yeah, literally like that far. Let it go to the bottom. See, my shrimp did the same thing, just upside down going down. I let it sink all the way down. This there. is a new one. Oh, Ooh, got dude, got you got one. got one. Hey, he's got one. He takes a oh. Dude, that's crazy. What do you think it is? I think it's sheephead. Really? Yo, I saw your line, bro. <laughs> I was like, dude, that was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> that actually was cool. He stole it, bro. He bit it in half. Look. He ate it just how I eat it. Red lobster, bro. Look at that. That bite was crazy though, honestly. Just real hard thump. Gosh, all right, I'll be right back, Christian. Well, we officially had the first bite. I don't know if it was a sheep's head or a, a snook. All I know is he hammered it. He ate it just like I would eat it at a restaurant. You hook it right here. Nothing. Dude, he just came off. Son of a biscuit. Oh, lady fish. Oh, got my hook back. I dropped it in the dirt. <laughs> We gonna let her go. She gone. See ya. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, he's so big. That's a 40. That's Scarface right there. Oh, come on. I still see him though. Oh, dude, this is gonna be an impossible fish to catch. That's a monster. You see him? He's right out there. Yep. That's a Perfect, dude. Perfect. Fish right oh, that fish ain't getting caught today. Oh my gosh. That was a monster, dude. A straight monster. Got oh one. Chaz has got one. He's got a snapper up it. But it's a snapper. Oh, he's got him. Oh, it is a snapper. <laughs> I'm happy with that, man. First That's fish. First ever. Mango snapper. I wanted to catch one of these. Literally the exact thing I wanted to catch. That's the reason why I've been missing all those fish because they're that small. Yeah, look at the bait sticking out of his mouth. Hey, first fish today. I do not care. You broke the ice. I broke the ice. I literally said, Noah, I want to catch a, uh, what is that, mango snapper? Yeah. And I caught one. So, I'm good. Your turn now. Let's get it. Heck yeah, man. All right, so we're about to leave this first spot. I wouldn't say it was a bust because he actually caught one, Christian. Or you caught a snapper. Christian caught a ladyfish. Um, so we did catch Adam something. Almost put the giant snook. But yeah, that giant snook followed him back. That was scary, dude. That was crazy. That would have been so cool. Yeah. But um, we're gonna go to a new spot. Um, you know, we got high hopes. I gotta stop at a gas station to get a drink, boys. Right. Oh, I'm sorry. You know, you good, bro. No. It'll be good. Let's get it. Bow. Tell them to go around the roundabout and turn right right before the roundabout. What's up, guys? So we just pulled up to this other spot. Uh, the first spot didn't really work out in our favor. We saw a couple really, really big snook, but I don't know. They just didn't want to eat. Um, Adam actually had one follow his bait and turn right on it right when we got to the seawall. So that was a, a bummer. I was really trying to put you guys on some snook. We got this one spot. Has a lot of snook in it, so I hope we can get one here. We just got to the new pond. Third stop. As far as I know, there's snook, bass. There's snook, bass. There could be anything. They Those said it's brackish again. water. I'm just trying to figure out how the salt water got here. Got in here. So we just got out here to this pond that has snook. I'm just praying for one bite. That's all I want. That's my one opportunity. And uh, I'm going to capitalize on it. Got this little tiny swim bait that we're throwing. We're here at this little pond. I just want to catch one of these snooks so bad. We're going to make it happen. Confidence high. There he is. There he is. I got him. I got him. I got him. I got him. He's pulled. 
I got him, boys. I got him. I got him. I got him. Alright, bro. That's a good one. Nice one, bro. Alright, take it easy because you got light line. Yeah. Get him, Wes. Let's go. Got him, man. Let's go, buddy. Hell yeah, you're first. Ah. Let's go, buddy. Yes. There you go, bro. Yes. Woo wee. Dude, we did it. I said it the cast before. I said my confidence is through the roof. Like, we're about to make it happen right now, and we just did. Right there, that positive energy, guys. Positive vibes. That's what it gets you right there. We've been hunting all day. We made it happen. As windy as can be. I apologize about that. This is a nice fish, Here, bro. bro. Hold your first snook, man. Oh, my God. Hold it tight. Dude, Good look job, at bro. that. Let's go. All right, guys. This is my first snook ever. It's just a blessing. It's made the whole trip, Weston. Dude, Dude, I'm glad you did it. Thank you Congrats so much. Congrats on your first snook, buddy. Man, it's just awesome to be here, man. We had positive vibes all morning. <laughs> I knew we'd get it it's done. Been, dude, it's been a rough day, and, and that's why you keep your confidence high. I talked about it. I said my confidence is up. Next cast, slammed one. We're going to get this beauty back in the water and uh, try to catch another one. Grab the tail. Okay. Oh, nice clean swim off. There you go. Oh. Nice. Perfect. Nicely done, buddy. She cut me pretty good. Up, hey, Dub. He'll be fine. Is he really going to do this? Is he ever going to realize that my fist is waiting to get popped right now? <laughs> Dang, bro. I couldn't see it. The Dang, mic was bro. in the way. I literally couldn't even see your hand. <laughs> wow. What an experience. That has to be probably one of the most realest moments on my channel. I just told them that was probably the craziest moment of me on my channel ever. And uh, not because of like just the content, like just the feeling inside. Like that was just real to me. I, I, I stayed positive all day. You know, it's been a grind. That's how this whole trip's been. Just know if you stay positive, put your mind to it, you know, it's gonna be okay, it's gonna work out. And uh, that's exactly what we did there and it, and it happened. I said I wanted one bite, you know, God was look, looking over me, we got one bite, man. That is just, thank you, Weston, so much, bro. Yeah, buddy, you got it, man. That was legit. And That um, was awesome, you really you, capitalized on that bite, dude. That, that was good, bro. But if you guys wanna see Weston back in the videos, drop a like on this video, subscribe down below. But I think we're going to sign out on this one. <laughs> I'll catch you guys in the next. <laughs> I'll catch you guys in the next video.